People who prefer to be alone often possess certain personality traits that contribute to their enjoyment of solitude. It's important to note that these traits can vary among individuals and not everyone who enjoys alone time will exhibit all of them. Here are six common personality traits associated with people who prefer solitude. Independence. Individuals who enjoy being alone often value their independence. They are comfortable making decisions and taking actions on their own without relying heavily on others. Independence is a key trait that allows them to navigate the world and pursue their interests without feeling the need for constant social validation. Introversion. Many people who prefer solitude identify as introverts. Introverts tend to recharge their energy by spending time alone, away from social stimuli. They may find solitude more refreshing and rejuvenating than social interactions, which can be draining for them. Creativity. Solitude provides a conducive environment for deep thinking and creativity. People who enjoy being alone often have a rich inner world and may engage in activities like writing, drawing or pursuing other creative endeavors during their alone time. Self-reflection. Solitude allows individuals to engage in self-reflection and introspection. People who enjoy being alone may use this time to understand themselves better, explore their thoughts and emotions and gain insights into their personal growth. High emotional intelligence. Those who appreciate solitude often have a high level of emotional intelligence. They are in tune with their own emotions and can effectively manage them. This self-awareness contributes to a better understanding of their needs and preferences, including the need for alone time. Low fear of missing out, FOMO. People who enjoy being alone typically have a lower fear of missing out on social events or activities. They are content with their own company and do not feel the need to constantly participate in social gatherings. This trait allows them to prioritize their personal needs and interests over external social pressures. It's essential to recognize that these traits represent general trends and that individual preferences and personalities can vary widely. People may also move along the spectrum of introversion and extroversion based on circumstances and personal development.